there's a great book called The Man Who Solved the Market. Um, it's by a Wall Street Journal writer. Um, his name escapes me at the moment. But the book is about Jim Simons, who's uh, a computer programmer. And he was actually a code breaker at the place before they called it the NSA. So um, he was a math professor. He's you know very celebrated academic. And then he, at the age of 40, decided to do a complete career change and become a trader of all things. Well, he tried to trade and it didn't work. Um, he tried to trade based on his instincts and information and things like that. And then he decided to program a computer to trade. And then the world changed. He single-handedly kind of ushered in this quantitative revolution. It pro- he wasn't the first guy to do it, but he was amongst the first. And he ended up creating one of the, if not basically the most successful uh, hedge fund ever. He's the most successful investor of all time. And he's not a person that looks at balance sheets. He's not a person that looks at uh, stock charts. He's a person that programmed or helped uh, hire a team that programmed a computer to trade automatically. And he made the most amount of money in the stock market ever. More than Warren Buffett, more than George Soros, more than Steve Cohen, et cetera. Hash? I believe they're called magicians. (laughs) <laughs> yeah, uh, the fund made around 80% a year for a very long time. So Simons has the, you know, arguably is was one of the richest people in the world. Um, if you sort of would securitize this company, it would be worth more than Goldman Sachs. Um, so anyway, trading with, with, with a computer is probably kind of like, um, you know, trading without a computer is probably kind of like being in professional sports or MMA without steroids. Like, you can try it, but, you know, most most of those guys are doing steroids for a reason. Um, and I think, you know, in, in this case, you actually don't have the downsides of steroids, you know, the health effects and so forth. So, you know, you kind of have to do it at this point to, to keep up with the Joneses. Like, trading without computer help is almost like as crazy as, like, I don't know, doing your own spell checking or, you know, whatever, like copy photocopying instead of, I don't know, pick any like archaic thing. Like, so the day of the stock picker, that's like a gumshoe that's like looking at balance sheets and interviewing management, like it's slowly starting to kind of go away, I think. And if you look at the most of the successful hedge funds now, they're, they're more quantitatively oriented, even if they're not completely computer decisions, you know, the computers are making more and more part of that decision. So I highly recommend that you Learn to program if you want to learn how to invest.